hi in the given problem here there are two straight conductors kept at a distance capital D between them and here there is a circular loop also which is touching both of these conductors like this diameter of this loop is equal to twice of r so its radius r d by 2 here this distance is d now the first conductor is carrying a current i in downward direction the second conductor carrying the same current but in upward direction this loop is carrying the same current i but in a counter clockwise manner so we have to find the net magnetic field here at the center of the loop which will be the midpoint of the two wires also so first of all using right hand source rule or we can say right hand thumb rule the direction the directions of magnetic field magnetic fields b1 due to first conductor and b2 due to the second conductor will be both of them will be outward out of the plane of paper and if we look at this loop this face of the loop will behave like upper face of the loop north pole as the direction of current in it is counterclockwise so it will be behaving like north pole so magnetic field due to this loop due to it means b3 will also be coming out of the plane of paper so all these three magnetic fields will be added to give the net magnetic field b is equal to b1 plus b2 plus b3 now using by and Sabat's law magnetic field due to straight current carrying conductors is given as mu naught by 4 pi into 2 i by r distance r here this distance will be equal to the radius of the loop means r similarly for b2 the magnitude of magnetic field will remain same mu naught upon 4 pi into 2 i by r and then for the magnetic field at the center of the current loop that is given as mu naught i by 2 r so taking this mu naught i by r as a common out it will leave behind 1 by 2 pi because first of all we cancel this 4 by 2 this 4 also by 2 so 1 by 2 pi plus 1 by 2 pi and plus 1 by 2 so finally this magnetic field here comes out to be mu naught i into 2 plus pi divided by 2 pi r which is the answer for this given problem thank you